the South Jakarta District Court sentenced businessman Richard Muljardi to one and a half years in prison after finding him guilty of consuming cocaine and ordered the heir of Indonesia's richest woman to go to rehab. The defendant acknowledged his mistakes and promised not to do them again and asked to be given the opportunity to undergo rehabilitation. The defendant also has never been convicted in such a case before, presiding judge Chris Nugroho said on Thursday as quoted by Antara. The court also returned Richard's black iPhone 10 that had been seized as evidence and ordered that an Australian dollar bill Richard had been using to snort the cocaine at the time of his arrest be destroyed. He was arrested on August 22 after a police officer happened to catch him snorting cocaine inside the toilet of a restaurant in the Pacific Place Mall in South Jakarta. The prosecutor, who earlier demanded the businessman be sentenced to one year in prison, said that Richard was proven guilty of violating Article 127 of Law No. 35-2009 on narcotics. Richard is the director of oil, gas and mining company P.T. Muliagraha Abadi and the eldest son and heir of its owner, Sujit Tuhusodo Muljardi. He is a grandson of pharmaceuticals tycoon Kartini Muljardi. Kartini, with a net worth of $680 million, is ranked 44 in Forbes' 2017 list of the 50 richest Indonesians, GGQ.